वेलकम बैक टू पैनल डे सुपर हीरो जहाय दिस इज तुषार टुडे विल ट्राई टू डू समथिंग डिफरेंट सो आई हैव जस्ट टेकन अ रैंडम सैंपल ऑफ सम कॉमिक बुक्स ऑन किंडल एंड विल जस्ट ट्राई टू गो थ्रू देम एंड आई सी विच वंस आई लाइक आई ट्राई टू नॉट मेक इट टू लॉन्ग आई ट्राइम दिस फॉर टेन मिनट्स एंड सी इफ इट्स डिफरेंट पार्ट्स सो दीज आर सम ऑफ द बुक्स दैट आई बेसिकली गॉट सम रिकमेंडेशन फ्राम वॉचिंग फ्यू वीडियोज सो आई वॉच फॉर द लव ऑफ कॉमिक्स uh anshuman and uh, i saw his shelf one video and that by itself gave me around 20 30 books so i just saw which ones are available on kindle and i just uh, took their samples and then there is another channel no at comics in panel so <clears throat> i saw some books uh, uh, that he had bought recently and i saw i tried checking if there's digital versions available of those and let's see how it goes so yeah the first book is called batman volume 8 super heavy so let's see what it is uh, it's written by scott snyder so i typically love scott snyder and greg capullo they are behind the night of owls uh, batman series so there's no doubt about it being good so let me see how it is It looks quite interesting. So that's about Batman Volume Eight, super heavy. Let's move on to the next one. So uh, FTLO was talking about some Spider-Man books by Dan Slott, and I was. It took me back to the times I used to read a lot of Spider-Man books. So I thought I'll just sample some of them. So this one is called Goblin Nations. I it had a really cool cover, and uh, you can see the cover here. Goblin Nation number one, and it's classic Dan Slott, colorful books, and uh, this the main villain is Green Goblin. So, looks pretty interesting, and I think it's a later volume. So uh, there's already a lot of things happening, as the name suggests. I think it's been taken over by uh, the Green Goblin, and you know uh, Peter Osborn and. is trying to fight it out there is some other villains uh, that i can see here i can see doc ock i can see peter parker here i can see j jonah jameson yeah does it have no it's not miles morales okay i'll have to read it to see but as of now i think there's a like a villain team up happening here and uh, there's a me and my army so these are all are they green goblin i don't know yeah so it looks interesting uh, superior spider man volume 6 goblin nation let's see some other books so this is the parker luck by dan slot amazing spider man these were bright and easy books and uh, this is called the amazing spider man lucky to be alive and uh, this is some sort of a origin story they have given and yeah this is pretty much the the book starts here so it's typical spiderman book there is nothing to comment much here so dan slot writes book in a certain kinetic way and that's how it is now for something different so these are showcase books i know they they come quite expensive uh, in india they come around 6 or 7000 and um i thought why not see if if something is available so this is and these are all uh, books from the uh, i don't know what's the classification maybe the golden age 1950s so this one is called the space ranger uh, as you can see typical classic science fiction trashy uh, cover the space ranger the great plutonium plot very nice art as usual and yeah these are quite well scanned so the they can be read i mean the panels are okay not great uh 
but still they could be read i believe and uh, if you put the page length bigger in a larger size then it's little better so this is one showcase book that i know there's quite a few showcase books so let's get through them this is the power girl again amazing cover uh, all star comics showcase presents power girl paul levitz so this is not from the 50s this is i think a newer book i think this typically would have been written in the 90s uh, it has that 90s x men kind of vibe here very x men type of thing and who has illustrated it okay so the artists are joe staten and joe orlando orlando not aware of them but it's quite good i think orlando has done some x-men books okay let's get to some more showcase books and this is again looks like an old book the planet and the pendulum the adventures on other worlds uh, i think this also yeah this looks like an old book this is one of those weird bizarre science fiction books i don't know if these are some characters or it's just a world uh, they do talk about run planet so might be uh, something to do with the universe in run and thanagar uh, okay let's get to next book showcase adam strange this one is more uh, known the character so there is a meteor and the girl is being pulled uh, and she's calling out to adam for help challenge of the star hunter quite nice uh, cover here uh, there is some alien creatures here and there is a lead couple and there is some indiana jones type of stuff happening here not bad kind of like a medieval science fiction blending okay so this was showcase and all the showcase books the year is written so this is 1956 to 1978 it compiles those books um, this one is again uh, 56 to 78 and so on so let's get to some other books while we still have some time so this one is love and rockets so love and rockets is a famous series by the hernandez brothers gilbert and amy and uh, there is a uh, it was a cult series and uh, it explored a lot of themes that are uh, more prominent now but it was quite ahead of its time in its typical uh, indie comic aesthetic so lot of uh, verbs a lot of words and uh, yeah so quite adult themes here okay uh, so let's get to the next book which one is next is gotham central so this is a, i saw uh, also the gotham central omnibus so i thought i'll just check check out some books so this is i think a newer book book 3 uh, on the freak beat and ed brubaker does a great job with these books and i think uh, i'm sorry it's not ed brubaker it's greg ruka okay so yeah i was mixing ed brubaker with criminal but yeah this is the book uh, Gotham Central and these are very nice detective story stories and uh, these are very uh, good to be read end to end if you get them at good prices and there's some great art here as well so this is about Gotham Central i see there's a minute left so let's see what we can check out more this is a newer book swamp thing conduit by ram v an indian artist who is making uh, who is doing great he's making uh, some great comics uh, in the west in the dc world now uh, so swamp thing is again a very uh, challenging character to take on and uh, i hear he's doing a great job there is some great art here as well i believe there's some spanish artist i have not read uh, uh, okay john mccrea is the artist and ram ram is the writer so again something that i am not sure if i'll be checking out soon i'm very fond of the old swamp thing but yeah ram v is definitely a great writer to uh, check out so the last book today is called barbaric uh, as the title suggests it looks quite dark it has a mike minola minola type of aesthetic and uh, a very interesting art uh, and looks like a uh, like a very well drawn book So that's about uh, part